Hey everybody! We are here to unbox again! You probably think I'm dressed up, but really I'm not. Look. Sweats! It's the stay home necessity. My finger, my freaking finger. What are people doing outside? Go inside! I have no idea, but my neighbors are out there just freaking out there talking to each other. They're not even wearing any protection. They're just out there like touching each other and stuff. So they need to go back in their freaking homes so they don't infect each other. So Luckily, I don't, I don't socialize with my neighbors. That's so bad. I am going to unbox. And if you like these types of videos where I unbox style, I purchase authentic evil twin <laughs> bags and shoes and clothes and just all that. And I DIY stuff. I do inspections and I haven't done one lately. And don't make me feel guilty. I, I, I'm going to make another one. <laughs> and I don't know. If you like these types of videos, please like and subscribe. Let's get to it. I received this baby. I thought it was gonna <sighs> caught you. And yes, I got Mo Gucci. Got Mo Gucci. So let's give her an open. I also got this lovely, which you shall see. This is a cute Burberry dress. Let's see, we shall try this on. She does have a drawstring to give you that cinch waist. She has these cute buttons that don't say Burberry. Anyway, so there is the tag and it does feature shoulder thingamabobbers. She does have buttons and she has pockets. Pockets. Nice. Very cute. And it seems pretty long, which is good. It is not a short dress at all. It has a collar, as you can see. So I should style this baby soon. We should just put it on! Put it on, girl, put it on. What do you think, people? I think it is adorable. I love how the collar goes up. This actually cinches. You could just wear it like blocky. It is big. Or, do what I did and just cinch it up. Also, let's put some shoes on. So I put these shoes on, my Gucci Marmots, and you could dress it down and put sneakers on. And let me see, probably a jean jacket. Beer. I think that's adorable. I think I'm missing a bag. Let's put a bag on. So I'm putting my waist bag here. Um, but I think it's so adorable. Maybe we could fix this. I hope the waist bag. That's so cute. Leave the jean jacket open moment and just have this cute waist bag. The matching Gucci Marmont pumps. It's so cute. Oh, and the matchy. Gotta match everything. Because where are we going? And nowhere. Next up are these shoes. So a lot of you are familiar with the shoe. Wow, it looks nice. Familiar with this shoe already. And I'm turn this down. It features the pearls and the studs, and in the back, spikes which is my favorite thing. Inside has the Gucci thingamabobber. 
the innards. Innards is not special. Kind of sad. Kind of sad, but who's going to go in my freaking shoe like that? If you do, then you trouble. So this is the other side of this shoe. You can see that one is green and one is red. Okay, here is the red ones. And it's really pretty. Um, it does not have serial numbers. I really should just buy these authentic. But they are leather. They, they have a little chemical smell. There's the bottom soles, which is good. I think all in all, I these are good. Now let me get my authentic ones. Now I didn't mean to go this route, but I figured I'd. These are my authentic Gucci um, shoes. As you can see, like the authentic ones that were at 36. And it does have a, a serial number. Let's see it. You see that serial number? So. So this is a 38, right? That's how like I could tell authentics should be a 30, I should be a 36 and this is a 38. So does this have a serial number? It does not, it does not. So let's like, that is correct in there. Let's see if I could, oh, they're like glued down in the authentic ones. So I am not gonna remove it. Why am I not gonna remove it? Because I'm not ruining something I paid hundreds of dollars for. I think these were like 600. So I know I was going off track, but this is authentic. This is evil. Okay. Also, let me just kind of show. Oh, authentics come with two dust bags. One, two. Authentics come with two dust bags. Evil twins, they don't, they're evil. One more thing, one more thing, and then I'll stop. Which one do you think is authentic and which one do you think is evil twin? If some of you said that this is authentic, you are correct. You can see, I know it's hard, but you can see the ridges and then like how it's, you know, a little puffed up where the Evil Twin is smooth <laughs> and just printed. Now, and you can see that it's like a, not super bright white. So that's how you can tell, especially if you're like buying pre-loved and sometimes you have to authenticate for yourself. So this is how you could tell like, this is authentic, this is not. And I wear a size US 7, so that's just to keep that in mind. Hmm, any differences? I think spacing. Be that the shoe was smaller. Prince. Not much difference there. Let me show a little bit more on what it comes with. Now you went you went through the shoes and um comes with this and this and one they too tiny this bag. You think of these shoes? It has spikes. Not like ow. Beautiful. Not like yours. Do you like it? Oh, it's so cute. Yes, it is cute. Who wouldn't want to subscribe to this? Thank you everybody for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.